Welcome back to another Benefi 2K video. Today we're going to do something different. We're not just looking at the player we kind of are, but we're not. We're going to do a video on why people should run power forwards. And we're going to feature Chris Weber, which I did pick up off the auction house this week. We're just going to go in straight gameplay, raw gameplay, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I guess what I'm going to talk about today is the, the, the lost respect for the position of power forward in 2K. I think that's my team online, obviously. I think that's largely because everyone's now running that five out offense. You come up against teams, and what you tend to be seeing in the power forward spot, unless they've got that Kevin Garnett card, is they're running either two centers or they're running a power forward and trying to stre uh, sorry a small forward and trying to stretch the floor. I think power forwards, particularly the way the game is sort of, I guess, developed over the year, where everyone seems to be running five out or or running gun that the position of power forward unless and that could be largely because there wasn't a lot of higher end power forwards who could shoot the three initially the other one you see the ruby jabari park is in a lot of play for that reason at the moment but what i'm talking about is coming up against guys majority running thing running like kevin durant a power forward or uh Giannis Antetokounmpo power forward or they're running two centers they got I see a little bit Gasol or the, these sorts of things, or Rez Unsell, although he's probably a bit of an exception because he's only small. Um, the power forward should be run because they have all... The difference between a small forward in most part is that they come equipped with post moves, and if you're running a power forward in a game, particularly when guys are five outing and they're spreading their D, he's going to have the athleticism to cover small forwards and centers regardless of what you come up against so from a defensive standpoint that makes sense offensively if he's mashed up on a small forward you have the ability to take him into the post and you're going to be able to have a power of him because what you'll find historically is the power forwards have got more strength than small forwards in this game and if they match up on a center you're going to be quicker than them as you can see here in this game here i'm running weber and i'm running uh mills up at the same time and it's working great and i think i've got six in those since i'll put two power forwards so I'm trying to, on my own, make up for the lack of them. Thanks for watching, guys. Please remember to like and subscribe.